shit too, Bitch, man. Only walk on my block, cause I'm shooting shit Ay. too. On my ops with a Glock, that's your Ruger clip. Bitch, only walk on my block, cause I'm shooting shit. Ah! What's good, Aqua family? Welcome back to another day with Megan McQueen, man. I can't show everybody the goods. So are we really going to forget what the fuck just happened yesterday? We just gonna forget that? What's good, Aqua family? You know what I'm saying? This is a different introduction. Welcome back to another day with Megan McQueen, man. Right now is a motherfucking, what, what time is it, man? As you can see in my voice, I'm still disoriented. For what reason? I don't know. Probably because yesterday I went to my mama's house for, you know, a pleasant reason. And turns out I had a fucking reunion. An unexpected, unwanted reunion. But listen, man, we're not going to worry about that. We're not going to worry. I'm just, you know what I'm saying? I just wanted to start the video like that because I just didn't really, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Nigga, I slept. I, I might have had bad dreams about that shit. Anyways, y'all, today is Tuesday, man. We're about to go to the motherfucking gym. It's about to be a lit-ass time, man. You guys already know. But Quinn, I try to push my work ethic. But through me pushing my work ethic. Trying to pass it over to your ass. My mouth is dry as shit. This water has been sitting in my car for a day. But it's water, so it doesn't expire. Starting early, man. I'm on my mamba mentality shit. You know what I'm saying? Did you know that Kobe Bryant, Kobe Bryant, used to wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning, go to the gym for two hours, practice, come back home, Rest. Go back to the gym from like 7 to like 10. Come back home. Rest. Go back to the gym from like 1 to 5. That was this nigga's work at the every fucking day. In the gym at 3 o'clock in the morning. You know how hard it is to train your body to even like consistently fall asleep at 9 o'clock in order to get those 6 hours of sleep that you need to wake up at 3. And then you doing that for the rest of the day. Like nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like that shit is crazy. Look how Kobe Bryant turned out. That's basically what I'm trying to tell y'all, man. Find what the fuck you love to do in this life. Double down on that and work at it as much as you can to its fullest extent. And you too shall receive your greatness. Because I also believe what Deontay Wilder said. There's greatness in everybody. It just depends on who wants to unlock it. I believe everyone has greatness in them. I believe every single one of you niggas got greatness in you. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta, you just gotta know, you gotta be, you know, courageous enough to step outside the box and be considered not normal. Do you know what I'm saying? I would say I'm a pretty successful dude, you know what I'm saying? And you guys know how ignorant I am. And you know, you guys know how weird I am. Fuck it, nigga. <laughs> Anyways, man, I ain't trying to get too motivational on y'all, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, you know what I'm saying, you guys know how I look. I mean, I just be talking to y'all, bro. Right now, you guys are in the fucking driver's seat. I don't give a fuck what, what y'all niggas said. My, my jump shot is wet now. Y'all can't see me on the court now, nigga. I'm a developed McQueen on the court, nigga. I'm Kobe Jr. For real. Anyways, man, I'm going to try and get some, some of that greatness on camera, and then we'll continue to proceed with the day. All right, y'all. Um, don't mind me being shirtless, nigga. That's just the name of the game and how McQueen is going to do it on this last motherfucking beautiful, sunny, California motherfucking day in L.A. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. You see the colors. You see the colors, man. 
Now, a lot of people keep motherfucking DMing me. Oh, bro, I don't know how you can keep staying positive through all this, you know what I'm saying? Damn, my nigga, like, how the fuck is you still putting out videos? Like, bro, thank you for putting out videos. That shit inspired me, man. And I really, really, really appreciate the love, man. I really, really do appreciate the love. But me, at this point in my life, bro, I've really started to realize that there is no reason in stressing about things I can't control. Do you know what I'm saying? Once you really, really realize and understand that something is just absolutely out of your control, then what's the point of stressing about it? What's the point of getting mad about it? What's the point of dwelling on it? What is the point? Ask yourself that. You won't have an answer. Because <laughs> it's not, it's not going to change anything. Do you know what I'm saying? And that's just one thing I've been realizing in my life right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, so with that being said, yeah, of course. I'm not going to sit here and act like I'm not fucking upset. Nigga, I was fucking crying. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was... it was. Niggas don't want to fucking, like, shed tears on a goddamn video. Like... <laughs> but, you know, I mean, at the same time, I don't really, really blame myself either. And I appreciate those of you who came to me and said that, it, you know, it was okay to cry. You know? And I had already thought so, too. But I just appreciate the reassurance. You know what I'm saying? I am a human being at the end of the day. I did slap my head and say, oh, I fucking hate being a cancer. Actually, I love being a cancer because we're strong in every single emotion, not just, you know what I'm saying, crying and sadness and all that. Look at 50 Cent. Anyways, that's besides the point. With all that being said, man, I'm not going to talk about this early in the video. Um, I'm just going to make this video as entertaining as po as I possibly can, because I like I said, I'm going to bring the best quality McQueen content I can possibly put out. You know what I'm saying? Before I go in, man. So um, ah, this will be the last time I eat a Fuji apple on the outside. This will be my last time cooking. On the outside. This will be the last time I take a shower. On the outside. This will be the last time I get in a jacuzzi. On the outside. All right, y'all. What can I say, man? What can I say? It's the end of the road, bro. It's just... I'm not gonna get all sentimental because I did enough crying and, and dwelling and shit. Um, like I said, um, I'm really listening to you guys. Um, a lot of you, like, honestly, like 90% of you guys told me to just stay positive and be... Um, just be, just be as positive as I possibly can and, you know, attract that good energy towards me. Um, and I just want to say thank you guys for all giving me, you know, all that positive energy and all the prayers and all the, you know what I'm saying, everything that you guys have been talking to me about in the DMs. You guys know I've responded to a lot of you guys. A lot of you like to try to come at me and tell me some, oh, you don't care about your fans. Stop it, man. You got to realize there's a nigga, there's, I literally have almost 700,000 of you guys, you know? So I can't get to every single one, but I'm only one person. Come on now. I, you guys know I love you, and I really do appreciate everything you guys have done and, you know, just everything you got. Yeah. I don't, I'm just all fucking discombobulated, man. Look, you guys get what I'm trying to say. Um... Tomorrow's a Thursday, man. Me and my manager are going to court tomorrow, 8.30 in the morning. Um, it's our last and final court hearing. Um, they'll give me my final sentence, and they'll take me in from there. Um, like I told you guys, the prosecutor and Dimitri have both told me that, you know, it's a slim to none chance that I'm not going to jail, you know? A lot of you guys have been telling me that I probably won't do the six months. Like I've said in the in other videos, I I'm not I don't know about this jail shit, so I'm not saying you guys are lying. 
Um, I hope you guys are right, but I don't know what's going to happen. I'm just going to leave it up to God. Um, but yeah, man, that's what's going on. I just want to say one final I love you to you guys. And um, like I said, man, I, I, I really do appreciate everything you guys have done for me. And um, I don't know. I'll be, I'll be in contact with you guys through mail. You know what I'm saying? I'll be in contact with you guys. I'll have, you know what I'm saying, my family members, you know, use my Instagram and my social media and everything to, you know what I'm saying, send out messages to you guys. Um, I try my best to stay as updated as I possibly can with you guys. And um, so... Yeah, man, that's just what we're going to have to do for right now. Like I said in earlier videos, my mom's going to be the one who's taking care of all the merch um, and getting it out to you guys or putting it in your guys' face. Remember, making sure you guys know that here's the goddamn website. Go and get your McQueen merch, you know what I'm saying? Let's rep the Aqua family. Let's rep the McQueen brand. Um, until I get the fuck out of there, man. So... Um, make sure you guys go down to the link in the description. Get your motherfucking merch. I will be streaming tonight. Make sure you also click the link in the description for the Twitch account. Go there. Follow me because my stream the other night was lit as fuck. And my stream tonight is also going to be lit as fuck because I'm going out with a bang, man. Um, so, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, man. Link in the description. Go and get your merch. It's, it's fucking late. Uh, click catalog on the left because once you get there... It doesn't show both shirts, so click that along the left. It'll show you both shirts. Go ahead and get y'all there, man. You know what I'm saying? My mom is going to be taking care of all the shipping. Don't worry, you're getting all your shit on time. Like I said, I am in control. So, uh, yeah, man. <sighs> it was a fucking mouthful. fool. Or ear fool. Anyways, man. Um, one, ma one last I love you, man. Thank you guys for everything. So I'm not going to get, you know, like I said, too sentimental. I'm going to just end it off right here. I love you guys with all my heart. And I'll see you guys when next time I see you guys. Because I don't want to say six months and speak that to existence like I'm going to stay the whole six months. I'll just see you guys when I see you guys. It's, I'm not going anywhere. I'm just... Yes, I am. But, <laughs> but you guys, what the fuck I'm saying, man. I might be going for a little bit, but I'm not going for good. That's basically what I'm trying to get at. So, yeah, man. I'll leave it off right there. Love you guys. I'll see you later. You see this motherfucking website. It's beautiful. You see trunks at the top. Yeah, I'm representing for the motherfucking DBZ fans out there. You already know how the fuck we get down. Man, get your motherfucking McQueen merch. You see the shop. It's beautiful. It's eye-catching. Get your McQueen merch. You see the black. You see the white. It's beautiful, man. Get your McQueen merch right now, man. Link in the description, nigga. Go!